Hi guys, it's Amy with A2Z Stamping. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make these cute little bows that you could put on packages or on projects. Here's one right here, isn't that so cute? And um, I'm using up some of my um, scraps from the Be Merry designer series paper. But you could do these in any designer series paper you like uh, to put on birthday packages or whatever. They're really cute. Uh, my friend showed me how to make some of these and I thought I would um, do a video and show you guys. Okay, so what you need is you pick out whatever paper you want to use and you'll need three pieces of that. So you need one that's well, one inch by six inches. You need one that's one inches by three and a half inches. And then you need a tiny little piece that is a quarter inch by one and a quarter inches. All right. So we're going to start with the big piece. So this, as you can see, this is a great way to use up your scraps. That's why I always hold on to these scrap pieces. All right. And you need your envelope punch board. And what you're going to do is you're going to line it up at three inches and you're just gonna punch and then flip it around 180 degrees and do the same thing so at three inches and punch so you want it to look just like this all right then you want to line up your ends right here where they punch and you can see it right in the center where the cutter is you'll be able to see it on your punch board so go ahead and line up the end right there with that and punch and then do the other end and punch and then flip it around and do the other sides punch and punch all right so this is what it'll look like right now then go ahead and grab a pen or your bone folder or your paper piercing tool or whatever you have and go ahead and just kind of round this so it curls okay like so move this out of the way okay then you're gonna take your adhesive I'm gonna use my fast fuse you could use whatever adhesive you have and I'm just going to actually grab this scrap here and I'm going to run that right up the center. So we're going to stick down one side right here and I'm going to run a little bit more and then this one's going to go right here and this is the start of our bow as you can see right there. Okay. Next thing is we're gonna take this little tiny strip that we have, and that's what we're gonna wrap around the middle. And I'm going to go ahead and put adhesive along this whole thing. You could use tear and tape on this. I mean, you could use snail, but I want something really strong because I don't want it to come apart at all. So I'm just going to flip it over and start on the bottom and then just wrap that little cute little piece around. like so okay and give that a pinch okay so there's the top of our bow okay and then with this bottom piece here pull our punch board back in so this is the one by three and a half inch piece and what we want to do with this one is we want to go ahead and punch it at one and three quarters so line it up at one and three quarters and we're going to punch and then again flip it around again one and three quarters punch and now this time for the end, we're gonna feed it in this way and just try to get it right centered exactly and punch. So see, that's not that wasn't totally centered, but I can live with that. And one more. And punch. Okay. Okay, so this is our, the little bottom. And what you wanna do is, we don't want it straight like this because it won't look as cute. We want it to come down a little. So just go ahead and use your fingers to manipulate it a little and just kind of fold it down. So now it's kind of We've got a little, we made a V, you see that? So we just made a V, okay? And we're gonna stick our adhesive on this again. Actually, I'm gonna turn it around this way. Okay. And then this goes right on the top. Like so. And that is our cute little bow. Isn't that adorable? These be so cute on packages. Okay, but this is a great way to use up a bunch of your scraps. You can make a whole bunch of these up at once and just have them to use. Isn't that so cute? I think it's adorable. And again, here's one I did earlier in the Cherry Cobbler. All right. 
And you could make the little band in the center. You could flip it around and use the other side of the designer series paper. But I think these are so cute. And they are so easy to make. So anyway, if you need a quick bow for something, use up your paper scraps. Anyway, I hope you guys will um, subscribe to my YouTube channel and find me on Facebook, A2Z Stamping. Thanks, guys. Bye.